It has been a sore spot for drivers, and now traffic troubles surrounding a busy shopping area could soon be getting some help. Five on your side, consumer advocate Jonathan Walsh, live in our newsroom. And Jonathan, it's Christmas crunch time. Oh, absolutely. This past week has been especially busy for the area around South Park Mall in Strongsville. Now, we uncovered some interesting details about I 71 and Route 82 as the city is hoping to take the Grinch out of holiday traffic and more. Bumper to bumper traffic took on a whole new meaning for Maddie Gardner. In the same area where tires come to a stop, her bumper did not as she got into an accident around I 71 and 82. It's always like packed, a lot of traffic, a lot of people driving. She's not the only driver that's noticed the snarls, the horns, the delays in the past. It's been backed up off the freeway, off the off ramp, way back. There's too many people coming from the other direction, I think. We searched through these calls for service around 71 and 82, more than 600 in the past few years alone. Hundreds for traffic stops, dozens for injury and non injury accidents, reckless operation. Well, we want to move traffic. Tom Persiak is the mayor of Strongsville. He and council just signed this ordinance looking for federal aid for times when even emergency crews get into their own traffic emergency. The idea is to widen the on ramp of 71 North to accommodate two lanes to keep people moving and not in a sea of brake lights. Sometimes not only one lane, two lanes, three lanes, trying to merge into one. And that really creates issues. Drivers who were stopped say that's a good idea, including Gardner, who doesn't want another incident like this. It'd be safer if there was like not as much traffic. Now, the mayor tells us the project should start in 2016. Meanwhile, he says the city and ODOT continue to work together to try and figure out what to do with the I 71 South and 82 West traffic as well. I'm five on your side, consumer advocate Jonathan Walsh.